Hi all, one of the great things with the new Google Earth uh, is the fact that you can go into your places and import KML files. And the KML standing for Key Markup Language, you don't really need to know that. But the great thing about it is you can download these files and then put them into your bookmarks. Now I've been playing around with a few different apps and I came across an app called Fulcrum. And the beauty about this particular one is that you can create forms uh, and send them to your mobile. So when you're out in the field, you can collect data such as text, photographs, audio and video and have that uploaded and into the Fulcrum site and then download that as a KML file so that they will appear in your maps as well with all of the audio, all of the video and all of the text as well that you've collected along the way. So how does it work? Well, Fulcrum gives you a 30 day free trial first off. Uh, after that, it is a paid service by the month which could put a few uh, you know places like education facilities um, you know at a disadvantage but let's have a look let's build one from scratch uh, you can see one i actually made one here called geo mapping but i'll just go uh, build from scratch do it again so what we've got here we've got all these different fields so i can put in a text uh, where i just want to um, details event uh, we can have that as a required field. And then you might want to put in your date because date's always very good. And scrolling down through here, we can put in a photo. And when we bring up a photo, uh, we can see whether we want it required. We don't have to. And then we can put in a video. And you can see it's GPS tracked enabled. And then our audio as well. And you can also have that GPS tracked as well. So when you've got that, you then just give it a name. So go tag event take two. And you can put a little description, all these other things there, and save and exit. And then when you go to your actual device, uh, you'll actually be able to see that form and uh, I'll add that to this video at the end. But Fulcrum is a pretty good app to use in conjunction with your Google Earth, and I'll show that in the next part of the film. Okay, now that I've come back to the desktop, I can see that my one record is now in here. I can click on view the data if I wanted to. And I'll show you where those particular placements are. You can click on that data and it'll give you some more information with regards to that, as well as also if you wanted to click on the map, you can then bring that up as well. You can then preview the photographs or any videos that you've got there. You can just click on the audio. 
This is a test. This is a test. This is a test. Okay, and you've got this all your data. That's test. there. Your this latitude, the longitude. That's there. <coughs> so we've done that. Um, so what we're up to is at this stage now. If we go back to our data on that main page, is we want to export that. Right, and we've got a whole range of different ways of doing this and we want to go as a KML because we want to put this into our Google Earth. So we download that as a KML, include your photos, uh, include GPS data. Uh, full. Okay, and that's the one that we want. It's the geotagged event too. That's the one that we're working on. Right, then we click on next. And radio finish, and that will now, it just confirms, it's now going to get that ready for us. So I've downloaded the KML file, and you can see that uh, here with the tag. When I click on the, the actual tag, all the details about the event were there. I can click on the photos, and then it'll bring up the photos that I've taken there. If I go back to Google Earth, I can also play the audio. Long tag, so view audio and not play audio. And I can listen to that as well. This is a test, this is a test, this is a test. So I think that really has some uh, great advantages uh, for what we're doing with Google Earth and what you're wanting to do in classes.